Barbados has recorded its first two confirmed cases of COVID-19. This has moved the country into stage one of its national pandemic preparedness plan. This plan includes the activation of isolation centers, the establishment of a field medical facility, airing of public service announcements to limit public gatherings, and the reconfiguration of polyclinics as screening centers. The fear level is inevitably on the rise, and understandably so, but you are encouraged to stay calm and intensify your individual preventative measures following the guidelines being circulated from reputable institutions. Here are a few quick points. Prepare, prepare, prepare. Rumors escalate fear. Drown out the rumors and get the facts. Only share information from credible sources. Protect, protect, protect. Protect yourselves, protect your loved ones, and protect your community. Good hygiene is recommended. Wash your hands regularly with plenty of soap and water. Keep an alcohol-based sanitizer ready for the times when soap and water are not available. Avoid touching your eyes, mouth, or nose. Don't sneeze or cough into your hands. Use a tissue and discard it immediately. Sanitize your workspace, telephone, your keyboards, door handles, and other surfaces. Practice social distancing. Stay away from crowded places if you are feeling unwell. COVID-19 is not certain death. Yes, the coronavirus is highly infectious, but it has a very low mortality rate. Statistics have shown that 80% of the people infected have presented with mild symptoms and can recover in two weeks. The coronavirus can present with symptoms of fever, coughing or sneezing, and shortness of breath. It may appear anywhere within two to 14 days of exposure, and the severity of illness may vary from mild to severe, depending on the patient. If you have any of the symptoms mentioned, you are encouraged to call the Ministry of Health's hotline number and a team may be dispatched to you. The COVID-19 hotline number is 536-4500. Do not go to the polyclinics or the Queen Elizabeth Hospital. There is no specific treatment or vaccine currently available for the coronavirus. However, your medical or healthcare professional will provide symptom-based medical care, which has proven to be effective. There is no evidence to date that the virus is passed through food. These are just a few facts to calm your fears, but the most important takeaway is that the prevention lies with you. Practice good hygiene and wash your hands regularly. As they say, an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure. This message comes to you from the Barbados Workers' Union.